Well, this Friday marks Veterans Day, a time to honor all who've served in the U.S. military. But for some, the time serving overseas led to a new battle back at home. Luke Snyder is here for you now with one veteran's journey to find healing piece by piece. All of a sudden, it just, it, the atmosphere changed. It was just, it, 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 it rocked us. Jacob Scriba is an Army veteran from Lansing. In 2010, he went on a supply mission in downtown Baghdad when his truck hit an IED, a moment that would change everything. Believe or think you're going to die and, and truly believe it, it is a life-changing event. The attack left him and several of his team injured. Scriba still feels the pain today. I also suffered from strokes, closed head injuries, um, burns. But he says it was the stress of that day that left a mark unseen. The feeling of helplessness, hopelessness. Feelings that led him on a personal journey and one that started a new mission. To find something that I love, something that I enjoyed, something that made me happy on a day-to-day -day basis. He found that healing in an unexpected place, Legos. I was given, you know, the, this opportunity to heal through Lego, through something I love. So piece by piece, his work gave him his own peace, helping him rebuild his own life. Like our lives, Lego is one brick or one step at a time. And that's very, very freeing and very therapeutic. It's work that inspired him to start his own organization called Bullets to Bricks. Today, he gives out free Lego sets to veterans with the hope it can do to others what it did for him. It's such a wonderful medium for me to get out there and show other veterans that there are other answers. Scriba says too many times veterans feel alone. That this is the best thing for the world if I'm not here. And if I can stop that with a Lego brick, I, I'm going to throw as many Lego bricks out there as I possibly can. A mission that he says is just getting started. Here for you in Lansing, Luke Snyder, 6 News.